Show me your greatness. So I haven't done a mail day in a while, and um, just thought I would uh, begin with some of the stuff I've purchased over the past week because you know I've gotta make that gotta make a deck for next format. That's the plan. So um oh the hardest part, opening it of course. Uh probably get some scissors. <laughs> So I decided to play Shadows' format. Um, deck is uh, pretty poor, pretty awful. Um, Trishula is too strong right now. And I'm starting to hate how much it bricks. But, you know, I'm not going to any major events anytime soon, so I don't really need to worry about like doing well. Because, well, I don't need to, pretty much. So I think these are, yeah, these are just sleeves. Yes, KMC Hyper Mini Map. Never used these before, so I'm gonna give them a shot and try them out, see what they're like. So let's see. Mail number one. Let's see what this is. Things are so hard to open. A Shadow Games. I needed the third. I traded, I part traded for two. And most of the Shadow Core, so I needed the third one. And Shadow Games is pretty busted. I swear this card is like amazing, like because it lets you like not like brick when you open something terrible, like I don't know, like, all monsters, because the deck does that a lot, you know. What do we have here? I swear to God, man, I hate like the convoluted like packaging some people use, man. It's like just use a top loader, like really, is it that hard? All oh, right, cool. And they sell a tape, the entry point, because I don't know what is this? Like, why would you sell a tape this bit? I don't understand. Like, <sighs> some people, man. Like, look at the way I have to open this. It's a freaking card. It should not, like, need this much protection, like, outside of Top Loader. Really. Do you see how much I'm struggling with one freaking card? Wow. Oh, of course, and it's more tape. God damn. That is so unnecessary. What even is this? All this for a Pero Pero. Are you kidding me? All this for a Pero Pero. Um, I'm gonna keep that top loader. Freaking hell, man. What's this? Oh, it's a Spanish Pero Pero. That's pretty cool. I like that. Ooh, get rid of this shit common. God damn it. It's like, what are people doing that like need this much protection? I don't get it. Ugh. Then we have an English Anoyatilis. I've already got one. So, I needed the second. Yeah. Pretty cool. And number two, three, four. Oh, these are Ghost Ogres. So I'm debating playing Galaxy Cyclone and I'm debating playing Ghost Ogre. I just don't know which one. Ghost Ogre is pretty good against Klee because against Tower Turbos you can use it like when they go first if you open it. It's a tuner and it's light and it's secret and it's beautiful. It's such a great card, honestly. Um, I'm keeping these top loops. There we go. Oh, this one's from Italy, I think. I think the most important thing is I get my constructs today. Because I kind of want to go to locals today and play Yu Gi Oh! instead of just like watch. I don't care, there's just some jank like in there. But Arcanite Magician, pretty staple level 7 synchro. And it's kind of worn at the top, that's really annoying. What language is it? Italian. Everyone loves foreign cards. Arcanite Magician. Um, let's see. More. I really hope my constructs are in here, seriously. Oh, wow. Falcos. Because apparently I didn't have any Falcos. Right? Hard to get card. Um... Oh man, the sun, that glare, it just like popped out of nowhere. Two debunks. 
So the idea behind playing the bunks in Shadals is that you side it against Necros. So it's for the hands going into game two. Um, and you just uh, debunk the hands. But at the same time, like even if they don't play hands, then it's not that bad because like sometimes it helps you push through Valk. And if they're really low on resources, maybe you can like use it on Brian. I, I think it's really good. Like I, I generally really, really like it. I had no idea this got reprinted in LC 5Ds. Well, I had no idea. That's pretty cool. Um, doesn't look like my constructs are in here. There's one card in here. There's one construct in here. Oh, there's three constructs in here. Well, wow, okay, I got all three constructs. Awesome. These are Italian. El Bam Bambola Ombra. <laughs> Bambola Ombra. Constructo. What a beautiful name. That is absolutely fantastic. Wow. I am not regretting buying them in Italian right now. Seriously, that is fantastic. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, what a star here. Which, unfortunately, I don't actually need anymore because um, I'm. it's way, way too hard to make in Clifford. Uh, against Clifford. Like, they pendulum all their guys turn one, they make towers. And then that's it. They make towers, and then you have two turns to out towers, or you lose. And that is not enough time to set up synchroing for Star Year. It really isn't. I think that's all my mail then for today. Did I miss anything? No. Yeah. So this has been a mail day. I'm gonna dig through this trash and make sure I haven't forgot anything. But yeah, that's uh, everything I got today. So uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you for next time.